Malaika, I'm so excited to be here with you today. Should we have a look and see who else is here with us today? Let's have a look. Ooh, it's you! Welcome to Bible Class, boys and girls. My name is Teacher Nikki and I'm so excited to be here with you today. But you know what? Before we get into our stories, Teacher Felicia is going to help us sing the Bible Class song. Let's go and sing. Come, let's sing. Tick tock, says the clock, we glad that you are here. Tick tock, says the clock, God is very near. Tick tock, says the clock, it's time for Bible class. Tick tock, says the clock, to love and learn and love. Yay! <laughs> Yay, I love singing our Bible class song. It's my favorite song. You boys, did, you boys and girls did so well. Okay, this month we're learning about how Jesus grew up. Jesus grew taller, he grew wiser, and he grew stronger. And we're gonna learn how you can do that too. Let's sing our Bible Word song. Bible Words, Bible Words, Thank you God for Bible Words, It's the truth for all to read, Thank you God for Bible Words. I just love singing Bible Words with you! Hey kids, how are you guys doing? It is Jake in here and I'm here to tell you guys another exciting story. And I'm here to tell you guys about our brand new theme for kids church, growing up. Everybody grows up. Your bodies change, your mind changes, you change grades and you change schools, you're constantly growing up. And over the next few weeks, we're gonna take a look at how Jesus grew up and see how we can grow up to be just like him. Today, we're also gonna take a look at a guy named Samuel um, and see how he grew up in stature. Stature talks about your physical body, it talks about your ears, how they get bigger, it talks about your face, how it gets hairier. Some of the boys are gonna get beards one day. Ooh. It's gonna be weird, it's gonna be crazy. Everyone's gonna get big hands and big feet and funny things, but it's all okay because we all change and we grow as we go, yeah? Is that okay with you guys? And so uh, one of the cool things that happened with Jesus in his life is that he was dedicated to the church. Um, it was a law back in the day that said every time you have a firstborn son, the firstborn son has to be brought to the church and get dedicated here. Um, and we do child dedications here at Church Alive as well. I'm sure a few of you guys got brought forward and we prayed for you and blessed you so that you would grow big and strong in your bodies. Um, and so once they blessed him, they brought him to the priest and the priest played, prayed for him. And then you know what his parents did? They took him home and gave him dinner. He ate breakfast, lunch, dinner, all of the meals. And I'm sure he wasn't picky. They didn't have bar ones when Jesus was going around. All they had was carrots and beans. I'm sure they had some lamb and some nice things. But you gotta eat your vegetables so you can get big and strong like Jesus one day. And uh, it says that after this, after this time when he was blessed, um, he grew up healthy and strong. He grew in wisdom, he grew in stature, and he grew in favor with people and with God. And over the next few weeks, we're going to take a look at how you can grow in favor, in stature, and in wisdom with God. I hope that's okay with all of you guys. Um, one thing that I need to tell you, if you want to grow physically strong, you have to eat your vegetables. You have to listen to your parents. I know it's not nice sometimes, but your parents know what's best for you. You see, when they brought Jesus to the temple, he didn't know what was going on. He didn't know why they were praying for him. He didn't know what was going on, but he had to just trust his parents that this is something that's good for me. And you need to do that with your parents as well. When you're changing schools, when you're eating your vegetables, when you're just cleaning your bedroom. It's important to listen to your parents because they know what's best for you. Not just because they're clever, but because they were kids too once. They also grew up and they also had to eat vegetables. So if you want to get big, like your parents, like Jacob, like any of your other kids' church leaders, it's important to respect your parents and listen to them. I hope you guys have an awesome week. Cheers, kids! 
I enjoyed that story. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you, Malaika, enjoyed it too. Teacher Jaken told us a story about how Jesus grew taller. And Jesus was once upon a time also a baby. Did you know that you were a baby once? I was a baby, and even you, Malaika, were a baby once upon a time. And our moms and dads fed us some good food so we can grow taller. You can also grow by respecting your parents. Jesus respected his parents, and by respecting your parents, you have to listen to them. If they tell you to eat your veggies, if they tell you to go to school, if they tell you to do your homework, you need to listen so that you can grow. Malaika, will you respect and listen to your parents? Okay. And you know what, boys and girls? You know what, Malaika? I know a song that tells us about our body parts. Okay, do you want to know it? Are you going to help me with the actions? Okay, you guys ready? It goes like this. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. And eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Well done, boys and girls. Did you enjoy that, Malaika? I enjoyed that too. Boys and girls, until next time, remember, respecting your parents helps you grow.